Welcome back to Tropicana Bonsai. Some bad news. I burnt my bonsai tree. All right, let's get serious though. So I did the resiling of this tree uh, last week. Um, and with the styling, I didn't take an account of the fact that um, I got this at a nursery. Um, a big box store actually, not really a nursery. Um, I'm not gonna name names, but it's the blue store with uh, walls in it. And usually these trees are shipped out. They're in trucks. Um, not always care the best, and they're in, the, in a greenhouse and not exposed to the elements. So when I did the styling of this tree like last week, um, after I finished the styling, I just put it outside for like two or three days. And um, as you can see right here, the browning is it's a sunburn. The leaves are getting sunburned. So what we're gonna do here is um, we're gonna cut the leaves off. Get off all the damaged leaves because at this point. There's no point of having these damaged leaves. Um, so let's get cracking. So to get rid of these burnt leaves, we're going to cut off the petiole. So that's where the leaf is and where the branch is right here. In between that, there's a, a stem and we're going to cut that off right in the middle. And as you can see, they're getting a little burnt. And we're going to cut this off. And the point of cutting these um of the leaves are they're already um basically dead they're going to die and the fact is they're wasting energy now so when we cut it at the petiole underneath the petiole where the stem is there's a dormant bud so those will soon shoot out new growth so we're just accelerating the process and seeing the tree um energy so we're, i'm just gonna get into it as much as the brown leaves that I had um, so where I cut them off soon new growth will come out of the dormant bud which is terrific what I'm gonna do differently is this time I'm gonna keep it indoors uh, next to a window and wait until I get the new uh, set of leaves and uh, have it on a bright light before putting it outside so when you buy a tree from a big box stores um, sometimes you gotta baby them before putting them out into full sun uh, I'm really happy with this tree. Um, soon I'm going to do a restyle because some of these branches I don't like as much, uh, like right here. Um, I may keep them on just to have enough leaves for photosynthesis um, to help get more vigor and more health into this tree. Um, definitely a big mistake uh, that I basically burnt my tree uh, leaves off. And if I kept it out, probably would have done more damage uh, because it will worsen the health. You know, the tree wouldn't have the ability to uh, to create energy for itself. Um, if you learned something, hit the like button. Um, if this ever happened to you, comment down below. I stayed in tune for the end. I'm really happy because I want to show you the cuttings that I did uh, this week. Let's see. You see how... Um, all these buds are kind of swollen like white it's like growth these soon are going to be roots right here these swollen uh, so these ball like white um, growths are going to be soon to be roots even even cooler I got this stem right here that's actually shooting out new growth right here and it's about to shoot out new roots so this is really good and um, those are both woody and then this is like a soft cut uh, let me find it. It's like a soft uh, cut, not woody at all. Um, it's it's getting there. There's gro something growing, but there's a lot of success with growing cuttings of the ficus in water. But soon when these are ready to transplant into soil, um, I hit you guys with a new update on this. Thank you for watching.